Hello everyone, welcome to the Heat Tech. In today's video, I'm going to show you the problem I'm facing with the Alienware X17 R2. Uh, you, if you haven't seen the unboxing video of Alienware X17 R2, which was my first video on my channel, so I will leave a link in description. You can have a look on that one. So after a few months of use, I'm facing a problem with the Alienware X17, the graphic card nvidia graphic gpu is not working properly as uh, keep giving me a blue screen after playing a game or whenever i'm using adobe premium pro so i cannot able to uh, select the nvidia gpu only for the color range setting and other display setting and this will automatically selecting on optimize and even not selecting the auto detect GPU. So we'll show everything okay in there, even on scanning hardware issue and everything. I've been speaking to the Dell uh, tech support and they was uh, diagnosing the system remotely and they have tested everything and uh, the problem did not been resolved. So uh, they suggest me to uh, replace the motherboard in there because the problem is actual GPU chip so uh, the dell engineer is going to arrive my home and they're going to replace the whole motherboard in there so i decided to make a video for that one hope uh, hope the other people did not facing the same problem because i tried to search over the internet i did not find any of the relative issues in there so uh, with the dell old driver from the dell website and the working fine but uh, a certain setting you cannot change but certain program did not work for example if, if you try to play triple a title games in there after a few minutes it will give you blue, blue screen and uh, the system will restart if you try to use the adobe premium pro i will give you the errors it will not render the video properly so and uh, system heating up as well and it will restart if i try to change the setting with the nvidia property control panel and uh, it will not select the nvidia gpu only for some reason and system go hanged in there and you have to do the force uh, shutdown to restart to work the system properly on intel gpu so let me turn on the laptop and show you actually what's going on there and um, using my camera to show you guys what's the problem i'm facing so system is booting up in bios so as you can see in there intel graphics is working nvidia geforce rtx 30 80 ti laptop gpu is detected and everything is working fine so let's restart and show you so guys we are on desktop screen i actually already done factory reset window twice in there uh, once by the dell uh, customer service uh, he been doing some diagnose in there he suggests me to do the factory reset and he did use the ddu and display driver uninstallation from the dart software and then fresh restart and then install the other driver and update and everything so let me show you the g4 experience first I will show all the games and everything I've been installed in there just to testing purpose for the GPU. And as you can see, the latest driver is being installed in there. Okay, and other settings are been showing in here NVIDIA RTX 3080 Ti and the driver 536.40. Five, and the 12th generation i9 12 1900hk and 4k screen 120 pen, uh, hertz panel and you can see uh, everything is working fine but let me show you what the problem is so if you go to nvidia control panel and try to adjust the setting in there as you can see it is selected by optimize this one not detect the automatic it will only detect the intel graphic in there okay and when you apply and restart it will automatically come to the optimize it will not select the automatic in there it did not select the nvidia so only working on optimize at the moment whenever you select any of the option so 
to use the setting for the graphic card in here on your customized setting you have to use the nvidia gpu only as soon as you select in that one and apply that sometime it did work and but the system keep giving you error and keep resetting by itself and sometime it just stuck on apply now i'm going to apply and look the screen going on there so that's how that did not happen before that's the uh, first time I'm noticed that one. And before it was just stuck in there. Now it's not going to move anyway. So that shows clearly the NVIDIA GPU is uh, having a problem. So they need to replace the motherboard. Either give me a replacement laptop because it still have uh, more than two month premium warranty left in there. So as you can see, there's a problem in there. So now if I force shut, shut down the system and I will turn off, go back in there, let's close that one. So as you can see, it's not been selected. Even we did apply that, they're giving us an error. Now is on optimize. I cannot use any of the setting in here. The display adapter is showing both of them in here. There's no uh, driver issue, no nothing in there. There's everything is working fine in here. All the sensor working fine. Sound system is working fine. Everything working fine. But as soon as you select the NVIDIA GPU, it did not show you uh, the actual setting in there and the system will hang up. And I have noticed another issue in there. Uh, let me show you that one as well. In uh, window setting, you cannot change the power performance setting in there. Uh, this one is on a basic one. I cannot, I tried to apply the ultimate power plan and performance one as well, did not work. Even uh, Dell uh, guy who was uh, using my laptop uh, remotely and I asked him to do it. He did not able to do it as well. He says there's a definitely problem with the motherboard. So this one is on a balance. I tried to do is uh, in a command center in a CMD and uh, I tried to apply the ultimate power plan. It says is applied on and restart the system, but it not shows up in here. I tried the performance one in there, did not show up in here. But uh, also, it will did not show you in uh, Alienware command center. It will only show you the balance mode in there. So either they need to update this Alienware command center software or something, or I cannot able to do anything. This one is says custom power plan, but you can customize, but I will still show you the balance one. So only the balance one was working. You can change the thermal performance in there, but you cannot change the power performance in there. So you can select quiet, full speed performance for the fans, but you cannot able to power on the ultimate window power plan or performance one in there for some reason. I don't know other people have the same issue. If uh, someone facing the same issue, please leave a comments in the video. So guys, Alienware X17 or two motherboard had been changed. So there's a new motherboard on this one. And they also when the uh, engineer was replacing the motherboard, they have uh, squish up the cable for the LED panel on the back. So they have to change that one as well. So that's a new panel as well. So as you can see, there's a tiny bit color difference in there. And this is a new panel in there. But the problem has not been fixed yet. The same issue I've been showing you earlier on is uh, still there with the NVIDIA GPU is not being selected. I have to show you a couple of other things I have discovered. Uh, first of all, I have discovered that is there's a problem with the Alienware X17 R2 BIOS. The CPU is not properly communicating with NVIDIA GPU is keep using the Intel GPU on optimization. So second thing I have noticed in there, uh, whenever I'm using the laptop and try to select uh, the NVIDIA GPU is freeze the, uh, the display on the laptop. But if you add another external display, 
I will keep working on the external display, uh, but the still shows the display is freeze on the, on, on the laptop. So let me show you what I'm speaking about. So here I am on my computer screen and I open up the NVIDIA panel. So if you go to the setting, you will see there's a few option in there. Automatic select, optimize and NVIDIA GPU when you select the NVIDIA GPU only and apply that one and uh, the internal uh, the display on the laptop will be freeze up you cannot move this cursor and there and it just freeze in there so this whole display on the laptop is freeze I'm going to add external TV HDMI in there so I connected that as you can see the display on on the TV which is external dis display it is working perfectly fine but the still shows on the laptop the display is freeze so this is a lack of uh, communication with the CPU and GPU internally with the BIOS problem I can I can restart or as you can see the options are working in there I'm going to restart the system but the display still freeze until the system is completely off and restart again so as you can see on TV screen it says restarting and the laptop screen is still freezed so it is restarting now I'm going to in the BIOS setting and I'm going to change some setting in there just to show you guys so here I am on bio setting and if I just go to NVIDIA enable hybrid advanced option which is enable if I just disable that one and restart the system here I'm on desktop again and I'm going to go to the NVIDIA control panel again let me show you the setting again now I can able to see the full menu of NVIDIA setting in here I can change the video setting image setting and those are the stuff I can able to do uh, but before I was not able to change anything here I can select NVIDIA GPU only and apply that one and uh, the setting will be applied in there so there's only only the way you can get access to this one is you have to disable the NVIDIA hybrid option from the BIOS and then you can access to the NVIDIA you cannot able to change setting before that in system because the system will keep selecting the optimus or auto detect on which is the CPU and NVIDIA GPU will work sometime when you are playing game or doing heavy activities so guys this is my Alienware x 17 r 2 video pointing out the display freeze while switching the NVIDIA GPU only and accessing to NVIDIA control panel so even after replacing of the motherboard and the back panel the issue is still there this is not the hardware issue so far uh, I think it is a BIOS issue the communication between CPU and GPU is not properly been going on uh, with the current BIOS so they need to update the BIOS in there so thank you very much for watching I will be making a further more video of my Alienware X17 R2 review so I will be testing out everything else and I will be back with another video thank you very much for watching